It's noon and I'm 12 days late, or like 11 days late to making this video, so my bad. On the 13th of November, I was really bored one day waiting for my Zoom classes to start when I found that Amazon has live streams on it. I'm not talking about like Twitch live streams, but literal, literal live streams on the Amazon site where people are, you know, promoting products, encouraging people to buy. And the worst thing to combine with boredom is a way for me to spurg out online. So here's a little compilation of me doing dumb shit on Amazon live streams because I was bored one day. Enjoy. Powder ready. And we're gonna take this product and we're just gonna blend it out with the beauty blender. And if you have any questions on the- For some reason, I went with the bit that um, I was trying to find Amazon products I could buy that would make my wife come back. I don't know why I ran with this bit. It was just it was just funny at the moment. So I use it frequently on all the streams I visit. Process of concealing, highlighting, or whatever. Be sure to just go ahead and leave it in the chat. <laughs> she just straight up ignores my message. She doesn't want to deal with my bullshit. Like she has to stream on Amazon for makeup tutorials. Like no one wants to deal with that. And you also see that frequently with a lot of the live streams, they just ignore my messages. Just don't know what. You can already tell right now it's so minimal. My favorite part is with the minimal makeup looks, not using foundation just makes it look so much more natural. So Okay, with this part, I thought she would honestly say yes. It, it, it makes sense, you know, Minecraft is taking over Twitch. And every week, Jay Schleid is getting married in Minecraft to some random e-girl, so... I want to cash in on some of the views. Can you really blame me? Even though I don't put concealer on. Hey, Flora's in the chat says, hey girl, hey. Hey, Flora. So Flora's in the Okay, and that part actually got to me a little bit. Some random bitch named Flora came in and then her messages get recognized by the streamer. It, 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 it kind of cuts to the soul right there. You're just getting ignored, especially by such a pretty woman. Oh my God. Uh, but I don't let it get to me. I don't let it get to me. I just, I know I'm there just fucking around. So I just continue on. So I'll be wrapping this up in about 37 minutes or so. And, um, yeah. Let me go ahead and, uh. That was my best attempt to try to steer the conversation into something related to the stream as much as possible. Because, you know, like every makeup tutorial YouTuber or streamer in the world knows James Charles, okay? I know James Charles, you know James Charles, I want to have sex with James Charles, you want to have sex with James Charles. Everyone knows him, so this is my best attempt at it, and I thought it would work. We have a brand new chat from Delp Dust. Who the fuck is Delp Dust? Like what? It's not that, my name is three syllables long, it's not that difficult. Dal da Men. The, who? Who's Delp Dust? Smart check? Is he here? Hmm? No. Go ahead, apply this all over. Go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. Yeah, that was my last Hail Mary attempt to try to get something out of this stream. It's like, I, I really dug the bottom of the barrel to get this one. It's like, hey, you know, up dog, <laughs> why not? Other side. And it was completely ignored again. God damn it. Just like your average Reddit user who posts on r slash nice guys, I don't know why women will talk to me. I I'm still confused to this day. Sometimes you want to hear yourself or, or if you're talking to someone and, and cool. Love it. Love it that you guys are actually sound like because that's important. Now with this live stream, this guy was trying to promote and sell Amazon uh, microphones, mics. And I already have a good mic, so there's no point in me trying to buy one. So. I, again, I went along with a bit of uh, my wife left me and I want to buy a mic that will make her come back to me again Unless I was bored one day waiting for my zoom class. This is the only reason why I did any of this um, Stewart says it seems if you tap or hit the stand it can uh, introduce some ringing similar to the Yeti Yep, okay. I have a hard time believing these are actual people like adult functioning human beings with lives on there you are in an Amazon live stream about microphones talking about how great they sound and how they dole out the reverb. 
you are not a functioning human being if you do that on the daily basis. You are not. I know it's funny me saying it because I'm doing it because I'm just bored and whatnot, but these people are not human. They're, they're not. Where they're not on my desk sometimes, especially this particular desk because tapping and the things that's going on. So that's a great point there. Um, go over to my lapel so you'll be here. Are there mics that are small enough to work as suppository? Uh, explain what you mean by that one. At that point, I thought it'd be pretty obvious what I was trying to say. Although I, I couldn't remember if I couldn't remember fully if that was the correct word for the medicine you shove up your ass. And if you quickly look on Google, yeah. So suppository is another way to deliver a drug. It's a small round cone-shaped object that you put into your body, often into your bottom. Yeah, so it's medicine you shove up your ass. But I guess he didn't know that because my man's here is a mic salesman. Like, well, why the fuck would he know that? Hit that follow button if you haven't already. Oh, there were my instructions. They were hidden up at the top, the user guide. So here's the user guide. Um, here, I just want to completely derail it. I fucking asked an Amazon dude if he has BTD, BTTV emotes enabled, which, if you don't know, is a third-party extension that allows you to have more emotes on Twitch besides just the normie ones. It's a way to detect if your audience is super normie or weird as fuck. And, yeah, this is something else I just pulled out of my ass. God, the, the look of confusion on his face is like a middle schooler trying to explain to his grandpa what TikTok is. He's just, he's just fidgeting with the box. He's wondering, what is this retard typing in my chat? I don't want to deal with this. I, I kind of feel bad for that guy, you know? He's in some rinky-dink room trying to sell microphones to boomers who forgot how they got into Amazon in the first place. I, I kind of feel bad for him. And I like the fact that, you know, they're... The user manuals actually have a lot of pictures, so even if you're not a techie or not, you know, it, some of this tech stuff, sometimes the visual representations stand images of what the setup looks like. All right, so let's continue unboxing here. Yeah, and at that point, he just fully gave up on, on, on me and reading his chat. He just wants to get to his unboxings of USB mics. It's like, it's like white bottle, the guy, so. I left and went to some other live stream. $35, $40 on a King Surf pre workout. You can be the friend who gives them a single surf pack and directs them to Red Leaf, so. I bet you lads are familiar with the phrase, love at first sight. Well, it was in this live stream that it finally happened to me. I finally saw the woman of my dreams. And it, a little bit unknown, I want to be with the kind of woman that can beat the shit out of me. Because that's fucking hot, okay? And you can tell by this woman, she sells supplements, she works out, she's got the muscles, she has her hair back in, like in the, you know, the ponytail thing. So she can definitely just like clock me right in the jaw and I'll be out for the count. That's fucking hot. You guys can find all of those on the Amazon listings that are linked. Um, guys, we, as I've said many times, we're a fan. Have any questions, please always let us know. We're, we'd love to hear from you guys. Okay, now that is a good streamer. Open to their community, always taking in questions or inquiries that that lady that streamer she's gonna become partnered one day i can already see it if she moves to twitch she'll be partnered just like that is that a snap is not selling there it is yeah like that and um i <laughs> we just got a funny comment how about that lads the woman of my dreams thinks i'm funny it is flat. It's so simple. It's it's too easy. Too easy. Is this what's like to be a pleb in Pokemon's chat and she finally reads your donation? She reads your message and she thinks I'm funny. Well, that's it. It's too easy. Too easy. Do you have products to not make my life leave me? No. God damn it! I am scouring the earth for answers about how to make my wife come back and I'm hit with the giant no. Even she doesn't know how it works. Fucking God damn it. But we do have products that will improve your health and if you're healthy, you're happy and I have a feeling that your wife has a happy husband. So 
Um, have a great day. We will talk to you guys next time. I have no idea what healthy this, this woman's talking about. My, my daily diet is one cold glass of water and eight burritos from Taco Bell. I, I don't know what health she's talking about. I made it to another live stream where they were selling purses, handbags to people, but there are only like three people in the stream and they ignored all my messages, so I'm just gonna skip that part. All right. My favorite things about these letters. So my favorite thing about the cheetah clip. For this live stream, this guy was uh, showing off different types of knives he has that he wants to sell. And I remember an old meme, not really an old meme, but a one I used to have of cock and ball torture. And it's not like I say it a lot, except on my live stream on twitch.tv forward slash daldemet. Come join the stream if you want me to say cock and ball torture frequently. And I want to see if there are any knives that play a significant role or aid in successful cock and ball torture. I was an inquisitive fellow, okay? I had questions. I just, want, I just wanted answers, that's it. Recommend for cook and cock and ball turnip. Which knife would you recommend for cock and ball? I don't even, not too sure what you mean by that on that comment, sorry about that. He's trying his damnedest to not say cock and ball torture by changing up the letters here and there. He says kook and ball torture, cock, cock and ball turner. He, he doesn't want to say it so badly. Um, but this is the one I would recommend is you, if you do a lot of chopping or slicing. At this moment, I was praying to any gods that would hear me that this man would have the answers. What should I get my wife? so she doesn't leave me or come back. I, I, at, at this point, I forgot which part of the bit I was doing, if she already left me or she's about to leave me, I don't know, but maybe he had the answers. Finally, he would give me an Amazon product to buy. Which knife should I get to present so my wife doesn't leave me? Oh, but get her the, get her the Prestige series. The Prestige series is phenomenal. I actually don't have it here. I'm just antsy to get that knife. So that's the knife I would recommend getting for your wife, 100%. And there you have it, lads. I saved my marriage by buying a Prestige Series knife for my wife. It, it was so simple. Therapists and marriage counselors couldn't solve the problem. But this knife salesman, he has the answers. He knows what it's all about. Thank you, knife salesman, for your service. Or go for the Cheetah Series. The Damascus still, and she would be beyond happy with it, I guarantee it. Here again, the knife salesman comes with a clutch for a second kind of knife I can buy. I can buy the Prestige series or the Damascus steel, what was it? Damascus steel, whatever the fuck that means. So I got options here. Lads, if I don't come back for a while, it's because I have finally rekindled my marriage and I'm off in fucking... I don't know, Montana, living on a ranch or something. Uh, I personally think she would be at least, that's what I should say. Okay, at this part, I also feel kind of bad here. I, <laughs> I fucking killed the mood. I killed the wonderful interaction I had with this streamer by saying he looks like my girlfriend after the sex change. <laughs> I, <laughs> I do feel kind of bad, just like the, just like the dude who was selling mics. I, I completely killed the mood because I was being a fucking, of being a fucking dumbass. Uh, very funny. Uh, I love how I have trolls coming on here. That's really awesome. Um, but, well, I'm glad. But anyways, these nuts are all relatively very inexpensive. You can order them on Amazon. What's cool is if you have Prime, right, then you don't pay for shipping, which is really cool. Um, and just like that, the fucking mods had to come in and kill all the fun. It, it was... They had to kill all the beautiful messages and interactions I was having with this streamer. And just destroy everything. I was even about to type, if you look at the bottom there, I was going to type, Not a troll, you know, saying like some genuine message. But, no. Mods, fucking, fucking internet janitors had to come in and kill the fun. So, we've got it right here on the scroll bar. We're going to start there. That cheese plate, that will change your life. For this live stream, this woman was selling like winery and cheese things to the uh, to the stream. 
uh, you know, I'll admit, th this one, sh she was, she was also kind of pretty. She was looking nice. She was a little bit on the older side, but I can appreciate a MILF, you know? The last thing I want to do is discriminate against who I choose as my girlfriend because of her age. Wait to do one of the Zoom classes with Marissa. Um, so I went and I bought, are there some questions, Sasha, that we need to take? I saw something coming. Um, in. Which wine do I get so my wife doesn't leave me? That was the question we just received. <laughs> <What? laughs> buy the cheese, the, buy the book, make her the love cheese board or one of the cakes, and it'll be good. And just like that, the almighty God himself, Amazon.com, gave me another answer. I buy the love cheese board. What the fuck's a cheese board? What? Okay, from these pictures, a cheese board looks like a giant board that has cheese, meats, crackers, and fruits on it. So it's just a giant plate of food. I make my wife a giant plate of food, and then she comes back to me. I just cut up a bunch of shit, and that's it? Oh! I cut... I cut up the cheese with the Prestige Series knife that the other guy recommended. It's all coming together. It's all making sense now. I buy the knife as a present for my wife. And that present I can use to make her the cheese board that she wants to eat so she'll fall in love with me again. I've been so blind. It's so obvious. Thank you Amazon.com and your fellow streamers who are forced to stream for your services. You have saved my marriage, you have provided, provided me endless entertainment, and now this video. So thank you, Amazon.com. And that's the video. Thanks for watching. Um, if you liked it, subscribe the like button and comment the subscribe section. And uh, eat your vegetables. And I, I, I don't know how to chill out for my own stuff yet. I'm new to this fucking you know, watch the live stream, I don't know.